Okay, children. So in carbon compounds, yesterday I was telling uh, in reactions we have four types of reactions. Number one, combustion echoed, number two, oxidation echoed, number three, addition echoed, number four, substitution. Now today we will discuss about oxidation reactions of carbon compounds. Oxidation. What is meant by oxidation? In general, I'm telling oxidation reactions are prepared to concentrate. What is meant by oxidation? And yesterday I told about combustion. Today I am telling about oxidation. There also it is oxygen. Here also it is oxygen. Oxygen. But difference is there. Children. There combustion is in air. Heating anything in presence of air majorly, majorly, many times oxygen only will involve. But in oxidation, compulsory we will have only oxygen. Only oxygen. That too in presence of catalyst. Directly you take it means it won't take. Compulsory you need a catalyst. If catalyst is not there, oxidation won't occur only. Addition of oxygen, addition of oxygen in presence of catalyst. Combustion means heating in presence of air. In air, oxygen is also involved. But oxidation is only oxygen. Okay, children, do you remember in the chemical reactions, I told different types of oxidation. I told combustion. Oxidation in presence of catalyst, I told, then corrosion, I told, then rusting, I told, then rancidity. When I was telling this, I said I will discuss in carbon compounds. Oxidation in presence of catalyst, I said I will discuss in carbon compounds. Today I am discussing. Today I am discussing that only oxidation in presence of catalyst. Okay, children. Okay, so let's concentrate, children. Very, very important in board exam. Esterification, saponification, oxidation. Most important reactions. Regularly they will ask these questions. What are the esterification they will ask? Saponification and oxidation. How is oxidation? What is oxidation? Addition of oxygen in terms of it. So, alcohols, in the class, we will study that. Alcohols, only for the class, we will study What they will give us? Alcohols on oxidation. In presence of alkaline means basically potassium permanganate, alkaline potassium permanganate or acidified, acidified potassium dichromate K2Cr2. Alk alkaline potassium So alkaline potassium permanganate or acidified potassium dichromate, these both are excess oxidizing agents. They are called as oxidizing agents. What are oxidizing agents? What are oxidizing agents? They help in addition of oxygen. They help in addition of oxygen. Who is adding oxygen? Alkaline KMO4 or acidified potassium dichromate. They convert alcohols to carboxy. Alcohols are converted to carboxylic acids. This reaction you should remember. Alcohols are converted to carboxylic acids in presence of alkaline potassium permanganate KMnO4 or acidified potassium dichromate. Alkaline means which is basic, means in some base we mix potassium permanganate. Acidified potassium dichromate means along with potassium dichromate we use some acid. Acidified potassium dichromate. Potassium dichromate. 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 Mate, dichromate. Okay, potassium dichromate. This is potassium permanganate. This is potassium dichromate. What is the role of potassium dichromate and potassium permanganate? They act as oxidizing agents. Oxidizing agents helps in addition of oxygen. So they convert alcohols to carboxylic acids. They convert alcohols to carboxylic acids. So what is oxidation? Alcohols are converted to carboxylic acids. Okay, children, very, very important. So now, reaction. Children, be careful. First alcohol, can anyone name what is the first alcohol? Anyone? Methanol. 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 Methanol on oxidation gives methanolic acid. Methanol on oxidation gives methanolic acid. What is the form of methanol? CH3OH. On oxidation gives HCOOH methanolic acid in presence of alkaline potassium permanganate or acidified potassium dichromate or acidified potassium dichromate. This is first reaction. Okay. <sighs> okay, so next one. This is there in your textbook. Ethanol on oxidation gives ethanolic acid. 
ethanol or oxidation use what you mean methanolic acid what is the ethanol formula anyone methanol is ch2h what is ethanol add ch2 c2 h5 oh on oxidation in presence of alkaline k mno4 or acidified potassium dichromate k2cr2o7 gives ethanolic acid what is ethanolic acid from the ch2 ch Okay, one more. Propanol. Propanol on oxidation gives propanolic acid. Propanol on oxidation gives propanolic acid. What is propanol formula? This is C2H5OH. Add CH2. What is propanol formula? Anyone? C3H7OH. 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 Okay, one more. Propanol on oxidation. In presence of, if you don't write what is there on the brackets down and up, your marks will not be added. Compulsory, you should write acidified potassium dichromate. C3H. This is CH3COH. Now, what is the formula of propanoic acid? Anyone? C2H5COH. C2H5COH. Propanol is propanol. Propanol, propanol is propanoic acid. Next, butanol. Butanol gives butanoic acid. Butanol gives butanoic acid. Can anyone name? What is the formula of butanol? Anyone? Butanol. Or H4H9OH. C4H9OH. How to get next compound? Add CH2. CH2. If you add CH2 to this, you get C4H9OH. In presence of oxygen, oxygen, alkaline KMnO4 or uh, acidified K2Cr2O7, K2Cr2O7, you will get the propen butanoic acid. What is butanoic acid? C3H7OH. Okay, next one. Pentanol gives pentanoic acid. Pentanol gives pentanoic acid. Okay, children, how much you practice, that much strong will become. In textbook, they will give only this one, children, this one. But you practice till decanol to decanoic acid, then you become champions in organic chemistry. I told you many times, not for marks, not for exam. Prepare for knowledge. You should gain the knowledge. That's all. Gain as much knowledge as possible because at this time, except this work, you don't have any other work, no allegations and no pictures, nothing. No, only this. So happily they prepare all the things what we are discussing. So C5, H7, OH, in presence of oxygen, alkaline, KMnO4, and acidified, acidified, potassium dichromate. What do you get, children? What uh, is C4H9COOH. Pentanol use pentanoic acid. And last one, oh, okay, children. Anyone? You know, this I told five. Next five, you do, children. What do you do, children? Hexanol to hexanoic acid. What do you do, children? Hexanol to hexanoic acid. Okay. After this, what do you do, children? Heptanol to heptanoic acid. Octanol to octanoic acid. Nanlinol to nanlinoic acid. Decanol to decanol. One, two, three, four, five. First if I, I told, next if I, you told. First if I, methanol to methanoic acid. So finally, what I want to say is, in oxidation, in oxidation, alcohols are converted into carboxylic acid. Alcohols are converted into carboxylic acid. In the higher classes, you will study children. On oxidation, actually, alcohols are converted to carboxylic acid. Carboxylic acid converts into aldehydes. In higher classes, you will study. But 10th class, children, they gave this much. Only, that's why I'm saying this much. You practice methanol to uh, pentanol, I told hexanol to decanol. You have to practice everyone and send the pictures to me. I'll check and I will see who are submitting homework and who are not submitting homework. This is your homework. Okay, children. So, finally, last one I'm saying in this questions are every year they're asking what is oxidizing agent? Number one, what are oxidizing agents when you are converting alcohol to carbon? Okay, and write the reaction. Oxidizing agents are alkaline KMnO4 and K2Cr2. What is their role? They help in addition of oxygen. How alcohols are converted into carboxylic acid? Alcohols on oxidation gives carboxylic acid. Alcohols on oxidation gives that. Even in the sleep also, if I come and wake you up and ask you, you should say alcohols are converted to carboxylic acid. Methanol to methanoic acid, ethanol to ethanoic acid, propanol to propanoic acid, butanol to butanoic acid, pentanol, ethanoic acid, hexanol, hexanoic acid, heptanol, heptanoic acid, octanol, octanoic acid, nanolol, nanolic acid, decanol, decanol. Like that should be perfect, children. They are asking what is the role of oxygen agents. They help in addition of oxygen. What are they? These both. If you don't write under the arrow this board, you will not get marks. Okay. So for uh, remaining sums, you have to practice. Thank you.